A key distance to scoring is between 20 yards and 100 yards. It gives you a chance of making birdies in the par fives, or maybe you've missed a tee shot on the par four, it'll give you that chance of making your par save. Now the key to playing these shots well is being able to control the distance. I was taught a very simple method when I was young. It was called the clock face system. And simply by being able to control the length of my backswing and the speed of my downswing, I could predict how, how far I could fly my wedge shots, my 58 degree wedge, my 52 degrees, and my pitching wedge. So I'd learn to swing to eight o'clock and then control the speed of my downswing. This ball would fly about 35 yards. Nine o'clock, again, the same speed of downswing. That'll fly about 55 yards. 11 o'clock on my left arm, same speed of downswing. I can get about 75 yards carry with this one. Very, act very accurate and predictable. The only key, the only thing you really have to practice is being able to control the speed of your downswing consistently. Now the method I found, and the one that worked for me, that's just how I learned to make a consistent speed of downswing, was that I used gravity and rotation. So when I got to nine o'clock, for example, I would let gravity drop the club to the ground, plus some body rotation. And just that feel would give me a predictable speed of downswing and produce consistent carry, carry distances. So let's say with my 58, I've got three distances. I've got my 35, 55, and 75. I've got a distance now where I'm somewhere in the middle. I've got 65 yards and a par five, need to get up and down for my birdie. I can now work off these distances. So I know my nine o'clock is gonna go 55. I know my 11 o'clock is gonna go 75. So in my practice swings, I'm just finding somewhere in the middle or in about the 10 o'clock position. I've got my feel for my downswing, gravity plus, plus rotation. And if I just try that, I know this is 65 yards to the pin. Carried it a few yards too far, but really with some practice, you could become very accurate. And if you're controlling your distances within a few yards, which is achievable with some practice, really you'll find you'll make some, a lot more birdies in the par fives, you'll make less bogeys, and as I've said, it's a, it's a real key to scoring well.